Welcome Pisces. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Wow. Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. Okay. So um, this is month of September for you Pisces. I want to say thank you so much for being such a trooper. Um, you guys need to, uh, to find inner strength, especially at work. There's a whole lot of conflicts at work and there is a whole lot of uh, um, conflicts in the family. Um, for some of you, so um, some of you have to find inner strength, some sort of a information is going to be coming out about the family. And I see the Eight of Pentacles, do more. It's about more business, more work is going to be coming out. So Pisces is going to be a very fast space month. Um, new start, very, very fast space month and new start. Um, news about the family is going to be coming in, some sort of a news um, is going to be transpiring. I really love this because you have the nine of uh, uh, cups and no more competition is there. It's as if you Pisces have found um, your standing in this world. So congratulations. Okay, so um, there is five weeks and um, please remember, become a member. It's just $1.99. You will receive the extended of this reading $1.99 per month. Some people takes the $4.99, some people take the $9.99, but for you Pisces, um, in order to get received or receive the extended of this reading, it is $1.99 per month. So in the first, first week, you have the Wheel of Fortune. Congratulations, especially for the entrepreneurs, the freelancers. Uh, congratulations. Second week, we have a transition, a transition um, with a, with friendship. Um, some of you are going to be handling some sort of a relationship with a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn man. Um, then I see a new start is coming up in the third week. Wonderful new start, some transition. Um, I see your fortune is going to start rolling. Whatever that was blocking your fortune, it is going to be really, really positive. Okay, so this is going to be good. Um, then um, we are seeing um, some sort of a transition that is going to be coming up and it's going to be transparent. So be aware of this. It's going to be some sort of a positive transition in the family that is coming up. And this is going to be good. There's nothing wrong with you. <laughs> I just walked away. So Pisces, I really love this. And you're ending with two of your most beautiful energies, which is the energy of the High Princess in the fourth week. And in the fifth week, you are having um, some sort of information that is coming at you that you were not aware of. Um, but it is going to be... Uh, a very positive on your part so let's go in and check it out so you have the wheel of fortune and this is good for business people this is good for people who are looking um to set up new business i see a lot of you are working hard i see some of you could be freelancer and working hard um i see a lot of you are going to be put, put, um, put picking the fruits from your labors this is going to be really really fantastic and um, I see that some of you are ending some sort of a friendship or ending connection with a family. Now, it could be your ex's um, family. It could be that you decide um, you are ending a relationship or a marriage with a scorpion. Um, this is coming out. I see that it could be some um, a sort of a situation where some of you could have been married to a scorpion in a relationship with a scorpion. Um, it is now over and you're moving forward. Okay, so whatever this issue and the situation is, I realize that it is now over. Uh, so some sort of a situation with uh, um, the in-laws is uh, going to be coming up and you're going to be just uh, um, deciding that you no longer want to deal with these people. However, it is transpiring. Um, you wish to uh, move apart. Um, in the second week, the energy of transition is coming up. So um, transition with your work. Um, I see a whole lot of uh, um, work is going to be coming in. 
So it is not the end of a contract or anything like that. It's, it's just that uh, you're going to be receiving a whole lot of work. A whole lot of work is going to be coming in because people are going to be finding out and seeing what is the transpiring. And they're going to be finding um, out that you're good at what you do. And I see a whole lot of business is going to be coming out. And people are going to be like subscribing or coming to you, asking you if you can help them out. Um, that sort of a thing. A whole lot of communication is going to be coming in. This communication is as if some of you have reached your destination um, within your career field and this is wonderful and positive and you're going to be so aligned and really realizing and seeing that you have come to this last point in your life and this is going to be absolutely, absolutely fabulous. So then um, we see a new start is coming in. And this new start um, is that you are ending some sort of a friendship in order to focus on your work. It's as if um, some friends are taking up your time and you're going to be realizing, I need to end this friendship in order to focus on um, my um, career or my work or my stability. So... Um, however, this is transpiring. I see you're going to be more focusing on your work instead of focusing on friendship. I see some new opportunities is going to be coming up. Um, some of you, there was um, people who were um, a sort of a competition. The competition is going to be all, um, over and I see as if new doors is going to be coming up and it's going to be opening up for you. Some of you were dealing with someone who, who was creating a whole lot of competition um, and this person could be leaving or moving out of your energy and this is going to be good. Now I see new start, a whole lot of new start is going to be coming up. A whole lot of people are going to be reconnecting. New start with a family, some sort of an issue and situation that was happening in the family. There could be um, some new positive instance, a whole lot of messages coming into the family. And this is positive message. I see um, no... Um, no you know it's no problems or so some of you um a whole other um new starts with family people could be meeting um each other family and that sort of a thing then we see the eye princess and i love the energy of the eye princess because it's your energy pisces um because you're ruled by neptune um you connect with the eye wisdom and especially if you're a Celtic, it is going to be absolutely fantastic because you're going to be receiving some sort of an inner wisdom and knowledge. If your father was a, um, a Virgo and this person has passed away, I see this, this person is going to be connecting with you via the dream time. And this is going to be absolutely fantastic because this person is going to be aligning you and helping you with your career, your work and whatever you need. So if you knew a Virgo, whoever this Virgo is or was a haunt, a friend or whoever, and this person has passed away, they're going to be reconnecting with, in, with you in your dreams and letting you, informing you of something that is going to be bringing you a lot of wishes and dreams. Um, and, and, and this is going to be good because happiness and joy. Some of you who were in a relationship with a Virgo, I see that this person is going to be returning. I see that you both, whether it was your ex, your child father, you both are going to be creating a lot of uh, uh, stability only if it's a man. This is for a Virgo man, whoever that was in a relationship with a Virgo man. Then we are seeing um, secret is coming out about a scorpion and an Aries. Um, whatever that was happening and transpiring, I see a lot of emotional situation. Whoever that was in, um, whoever that was in a relationship or in some sort of a friendship with a scorpion and an Aries, you're going to be finding out some secret, some emotional situation. Um, some of you could be in a relationship with an Aries. You're going to be finding out some sort of an emotional situation that was happening and transpiring. And I see um, that you are trying to create some sort of a balance um, for this person, um, whatever you're finding out. So some sort of a secret, some emotional situation from the past is going to be coming out if you were in a relationship with a scorpion 
or with an Aries, is you're going to be finding out some secret about these people. Then I see um, the energy of uh, um, your eye princess, your spirit guides are going to be um, making something become a reality. Let's say that you were open um, to uh, open up a new business or to start freelancing, working for yourself. Whatever you were wishing and dreaming for, it's going to be happening. So this is going to be good. Then I see some form of secrecy that was kept from you. Some sort of a conflicts in the family. Some sort of a people who were blocking and having some sort of a competition. I see these competition are going to be falling away because people are going to be realizing that these people um, are not as... Uh, um professional as you are and um are not capable of giving the message as it's supposed to be or their work ethic is not as good as yours so whoever was um, um creating competition i see that these people are just going to be falling away there was some sort of competition on the work floor and i see you are going to be either learning something new re-educating yourself but i see that Whatever um, the competition is at work or what's happening at work, this is going all going to be falling away. So be aware of that. I see some of you want to work on a relationship. Some of you were having some conflicts um, and you want to work on a relationship because you realize that this is the, the relationship I want to be in. So I see and you're happy with this person, whoever you're in a relationship with and you're happy with this person and you walk to work on your relationship so that is just fabulous let's look at the cross in this reading so we see a whole lot of new start is going to be happening so if you guys are looking for a job a lot of openings are going to be there uh, a lot of things that you guys like a lot of opportunities doors are going to be opening you are ready and i see wow the door opens for you guys. I see a lot of opportunities is going to be coming in for a family member. And what I'm seeing also is that your wishes and dreams uh, is going to be coming through. And I see um, you're on the right part. Okay, so when it comes up to job and career, some of you are going to be finding um, a new job or a new career part. And you're going to be feeling very, very happy with this new career part. A lot of emotional situation is going to be worked out between you and a scorpion. Whether the scorpion is whatever that is transpiring, I see a lot of um, issues and situation is going to be working out between you and a scorpion. However, this is happening and transpiring. Then I see you're plucking the fruits of your labor. So some of you have been working very hard and I see the Wheel of Fortune is going to be bringing in the fruits of your labor. This is absolutely fabulous. Um, you are happy moving forward. You are ending the, the month with your wishes and dreams coming through about something. Uh, it could have been that some of you were dealing with some sort of an issue. Some of you are going to be moving forward, looking forward. Um, whatever the conflicts, the competition that was going on, it's going to be released out of your life. And you're going to be finding out and realizing that uh, it is good for you to just uh, um, create your own wealth. Some of you are dealing uh, with um, a boss, whoever this boss is. Um, whatever is transpired, I see that this person could be open up a new door. This could be um, your husband, whoever this man is, is a Virgo man. And I see that this Virgo man wants to return to you. He misses his family and he wants to start over. He doesn't want any more competition, any more problems. He just wants his family and wants to reclaim his family. And I think you guys should just give him the chance um, because um, this person is really going to be there for you. Whoever this Virgo man is has been... Um, with your family for quite some time or in a relationship with you or uh, was with your family divorced or went away came back I saw that you really need this person um, because you need help 
um um you really need to help so i see you're going to be um accepting this person i don't think you're going to be open up so fully to him because of um something that he has done to you in the past i see you're going to be holding him at a distance so information is going to be coming out about a taurus for a cup called men i see also some transition information is going to be coming in fast and it is going to be opening a lot of doors for you in the future. And whoever was trying to block you, hold you back in whatever sort of way, I see that this is going to be resolved. So I see a lot of you are working hard. Some of you um, could have a business partner. Um, I see you got to be careful because this person could be um, profiting from your business. So be aware of this and not sharing the profits. So this person could be picking the, the fruits of your labor and not sharing the profit. Um, so be aware of this. Then I see the energy of the Wheel of Fortune. Now, the energy of the Wheel of Fortune is bringing back some sort of a um, past issue, but you're, as this come in, it's like friends from the past is coming in and you're shutting it down immediately. Okay, so like they're coming in and you're like, bam, Mm, no, don't have any time. I got to focus on my work and career. I see some transition is going to be coming in. I see the energy of a whole lot of information is going to be coming in in order to help you to create a new future and a new um, sort of a stability moving forward. However, um, this is going to be happening and transpiring. You're going to be um, having some some new start. Um, to some future that is going to be coming up. Um, news is going to be coming in and this news is going to be positive because this news is going to let you know that whatever conflicts, whatever competition that was around you is going to be over. Your spirit guides is going to be helping some of you to accumulate your wishes and dream and this is this is good. Some of you are going to be finding out something about a scorpion and their family. I see a whole lot of information is going to be coming to you about a scorpion and their family. Something from the past with a scorpion or friends. Some of you is friends. Some of you is scorpions. Some of you could have been in a relationship with a scorpion from a past life and some information is coming in. I see a lot of you is healing some sort of information that you had. And this was emotional, um, various emotional blockages that you were having and you're going to be healing this. And then we see the energy of work transition. More work is going to be coming in. Some of you be careful of your business partner. This is a Taurus Virgo Capricorn. This man could be profiting from your work. The Wheel of Fortune is going to be bringing you some wonderful new start. And I see um, a family. Whatever is transpiring with a family, I see a family is going to be open up in order to help out a scorpion. Okay, so this could be a child. Um, it could be friends that a family is going to be opening um, their doors to someone uh, or a couple who needs some help. Okay, uh, then we are moving forward and looking and I see some of you, your intuition is going to be on target. Bam, bam, bam. Your intuition is definitely going to be on target. However, this is happening and transpiring. Your intuition is going to be at high speed, a whole lot of information. I see information is coming in that is going to be make you so happy because whatever is coming in for you, Pisces, is going to give you a new start in the future with, with you and your family. So some of you could be reconnecting with someone from the past, an ex of so, and you're going to be working to this, with this person to create some sort of a stability moving forward. So I see new start, some unexpected information is going to be coming in. And I see whatever this uh, um, competition is or was, it is going to be ending. Some of you were having some issues with Aries and a Leo, and this is going to be ending, especially if you were dealing with Aries and uh, at the workplace or a Leo, 
um, who was um, creating some sort of a competition. I think um, you're going to find a way to just ignore these people and it's going to be good. So let's look at the mirror. The mirror is showing that um, something is coming from the past. Um, some secrets that was held in the past against you is going to be coming in and you're going to be finding out, okay? Um, when it comes to work, your wishes and dream about work is going to be um, really what you were hoping for. People are going to be finding your business. People are going to be realizing how good you are. Um, a lot of you are going to be working hard and ignoring the competition that is around you because people who have competition with other people is because they're not uh, um, self-reliant on their self, okay? Um, they need to show that they're better than you. And if someone needs to show that they're better than you, that means they don't know what they're doing, okay? Remember that. So when people are trying to get in competition with you, you just ignore them totally. Um, so an ending is going to be coming up to all the secrecy that was kept against you. Um, and, and you're going to be having this new start. Um, definitely some of you are dealing with a scorpion, whatever the issue is, um, some um, emotional situation with a scorpion is coming up. Some of you could be really needing to heal some sort of, a. Um, issues with this person because this is if this person it is getting out of hand we see the energy of the king of pentacles and i see some of you um could be turning your back to this person um so um we are going to be checking out in the extended of this reading if you're interested in order to look at the extended of this reading with us we're going to be checking out to see exactly what is coming up and it's transpiring um, Pisces, you have a really, really beautiful month. Um, wonderful month. There is, it's going to be a fast speed month and I see success. Your, your wishes and dream is going to be fulfilled. Success is coming up and I see, um, whatever you ask for in this month is going to be granted to you once it's for a positive, to do something positive in your world, in your life. And this is going to be good. I love you guys. Namaste until next time.